here how you all doing so i thought i'd do a little unboxing video today because i came home well i went to work and i am in work because rue's not been well um she had like really bad like vomiting over the weekend lover so i am in work so when i got to work there was all the parcels from you lot waiting for me um so should we just get right into it right so this is my first box I have, you know, opened it a little bit because I couldn't open it myself. Um, I thought it would be boring watching me open it with some scissors. So, this is custom and bespoke products from home organisation to decor to personalised gifts and bespoke clothing. To see a full range of our products, check out our social media pages. I will pop all this info down in the description box. So, if anyone is interested and wants to check them out. Let's have a look. So, to Katie, thank you for your support. You are amazing. I love Jade and Sue. Or says, Jade and says. I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Um, unique treasure. So, let's have a look. Oh, my God. That's so cute. I've got so many key rings now. I'm never going to lose my keys, am I? Um, proud members of the Sh Mums Club. Oh, my God. Can you, can I, am I like a proper, like, YouTuber now? We do this, don't you? Oh, yeah. Look at this. And it's backwards in that camera, isn't it? Because I've got the selfie camera on. So, yeah, that didn't work. I'll put these on Instagram though, if you see. And we've got their little... Oh, you can get them on Etsy. And they've got their own website as well. So, I'll drop them below. Oh, my gosh. Look at the t-shirts. Wow. These smell really nice as well, girls. What if you were sprayed on these? I need some of that in my life. So it says Trady Noun, UK Trady, US Trady, plural Trady's UK, Trady's US, a person who repairs what your husband has fixed. <laughs> oh my god, I'm going to wear this as a random. I love it so much. Wait, I might need a few of these. That's brilliant, girls. That, that, this is such a passive aggressive gift for yourself to wear around the house. So anyone's like in the middle of like a home renovation or anything like that. Oh, what's this love? It says Geth on it. Oh, he's gonna love that. Hang that up in his room. Oh, there's two, there's two. Hang on, hang on. Oh, it's a little pink one for Rue. Oh, thanks guys. She's gonna love this. You, this is like, I'm not gonna lie, like really good quality stuff. And it's all homemade. That t-shirt. It's cracked me up. Oh my gosh, there's a there's a box in the box. And it's got the shit mum's club. Oh girls, I'm loving this. Look at it. And it's holographic. What's in it then? It's a little bow. Oh. Oh. Oh, I love the secrecy behind opening stuff. Wow! Oh, they're for the bathroom. I don't know if you can see. Um, they've got baby shampoo, body lotion, and bubble bath. I'd never think to get these, but like, I can totally see them in my bathroom. Oh, I like these. Oh, I have to put empty and pour stuff in there now, and I. Do you know what I have been thinking though? Do you hate how much plastic? And like I'm not an eco person. I'm not like, oh my god, let's all save the planet. You know what I mean? But I do feel like, you know, when you're doing your recycling every week and I'm just like, why is there so much waste? I wish you could just take like this to the shop and then fill it up with the shampoo you want. And I know there's places like that, but there's like nowhere local. I'm loving that box as well. I'm so putting my makeup in there. <gasps> What's this one? Oh, proud member of the Ship Mums Club. Oh, I love this one. Look how cute the logo on this is too. <gasps> you have to all let me know what you think of this because I think this lady and this company are absolutely lovely. So yeah, custom members book designs by Unique Treasures. Oh, love it. Right, let me pop all this back in a minute now because I'm just going to make a right mess of life otherwise, am I? Ba, 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 ba. So the next one is in this little box. This is Molly's Designs, Children's Luxury Accessories. So this is for Rue. Let's open it a bit. Oh 
Oh my god. I'm rubbish at opening stuff. I always end up oh I should have brought a scissors. I was this last video. You think I would have learned today, like bring a scissors. But no, I haven't learned and I'm still just gonna struggle on the camera for you all to see you enjoying this. So how's your day been? What have you been doing? It's weird because I'm like chatting to you, but we need to be like on a video call, do you know what I mean? So I can't hear what you're all saying at the screen. I'm wrecking this packaging. I'm so sorry. Oh my gosh, right. It's very sealed, right? So if the postman did try and steal it, he's gonna look a bit dodgy opening it. Do you know what I mean? So bonus you. I'm liking this. Right. I'm in. Oh, look at that. Fancy. Ooh, posh. With compliments. Enjoy from Molly's Design. I will pop Molly's Designs down in the description as well. So if you do like any of this, they're all small businesses, guys. So, you know, always support local. I always try and support local. Oh, babe. Oh, these are gorgeous. And the Shit Mums Club's bows. I've got, I'm loving these. You guys are all so talented. Like, are you? I, I am not this talented. Look at this, right? Oh, Bloody hell. Look. Look at these little shit mum's club's bows. And look at these ones. Oh my god, girls. You are. I'm loving this. It's like a little purse. You can see Rule Rock in this in the house. And then people are like, oh, nice purse, Rule. And then, oh, a bit of naughty word on there though. Oh, guys, not even lying. Yeah, I, I might have been for rule, but not anymore. <laughs> Let's just say that. <gasps> Molly, these are lovely. Absolutely lovely. You should go check her out. Absolutely stunning. Wow. Thank you, my love. And then I've got this one. Oh, a little bit of a big one. What is in here? Right. Oh, thank you for supporting a small business. And these are from Womankind and Kinds with Y. So make sure all packaging is removed for the wax melt for place. Oh, these are smell. I can smell them already. Mm. So I hope this package finds you well. Gone a little overboard on the goodies for you. I've included a soap sponge for you and the Trady Life. So Adam, a soap sponge. I've never heard of a soap sponge. And a couple of bath bombs. I love a bath bomb. And do a bath later. So I'll be loving life. A burner and some scents from my huge collection because why clean when you can have your house smell amazing? <laughs> so true. I've just been wax melts everywhere and I people are like your smells less. Yeah, but it's not clean, mate. It's not clean. Life is too short. Love Danny. And then also there's a code, I'll drop this in the link, but you can use Shit Mums Club with your little exclamation mark for twenty percent off your first order. That's quite generous, isn't it? Wow, right. I've got all these things. I don't know what they're called. Pompere, is it? Oh. So I'm going to just dig in. Oh. oh, this is a lime, Thai lime and mango soap. This is the soap sponge. So do you just like, like you would with a sponge, but it's soap. Oh my gosh. I've never seen these. I want to know what it, oh. It smells amazing. I wish you could smell it. Oh, I'm that. oh, it feels like a, it feels like a proper sponge. It's not though, is it? Look. Oh, it smells amazing. Genuine. I would never think to buy, I've never seen one, so I wouldn't think to buy one because I've never seen one. But I like, oh my God, I will try this out there, we'll let you know. I will update you all on Instagram what this was like. Can you just, it's like a sponge then. Just like. Do you know what I mean? Oh, it's a cute bath bomb. Oh, what smell is this? Oh, I don't want to... It's on the inside, the smell is. And I don't want to open it because it looks so pretty. No idea. I'm not very good with my nose. I don't know what things smell of. Do you know what I mean? When people go, what do you think that smell is? I don't know. Oh, another one. Greek for men. Scented soap sponge. What's that going to smell like? How do you make these sponges, guys? I'm actually curious to know. It's not a real sponge. 
Oh, I suppose it's lovely though. It's like a posh aftershave. Oh, Adam will smell a bit better then, won't he? Sinks a bit now, like. You definitely smell a little bit better. Oh, more bath bombs. That's gorgeous, isn't it? I'd love to. Oh, that smells like sweet deeds. I'd love to know how you guys uh, do this. Do you know what I mean? I've never, never been this skilled. I'm not going to lie. Oh, what's in here? Oh, it's a candle. It is a, it's a wax. Oh my gosh. I don't want to break all the tissue and stuff. I am. I'm breaking it. I'm sorry. It's this ASMR for you now. on me. I think it's just a little white wax burner. Is it a wax burner? Is that what they're called? <gasps> that was creepy. Do you that thing back? Oh, it's pleasant. I love it. Look at that. Wait. I will be burning my wax melts for this. Let's see if we can find some. Oh, I found them. We have four, ladies and gentlemen, and in-betweens and whoever else is watching. Look. Are they just... Do you know what really annoys me about wax melts? Is that they just look like really nice chocolate. But you can't eat them. Like, you're not supposed to eat them, right? Not that it annoys me. But do you know what I mean? Doesn't that just look like, oh, that would taste really nice? Like this one as well. Look. I'm like, oh, I'd eat that. And then, ugh, you can't. I'm saying that, Gethin eats the bloody wax off the baby bell. I tell him all the time, do not eat that wax on the baby bell. Do not eat the red bit. And every time he eats it, he does my head in. So we've got lime, basil and mandarin. That, I think that would... Can I pop them open to smell them? Oh, oh that's nice. That's what I thought it would smell like. It's like very fresh. Mmm, I like that. Right, I'm definitely going to be melting that one. And let's have this one. This is Vimp Door. Oh, I like... Oh, I love a cheeky Vimp Door. On a night out. What is it now? It's Port and WKD in it. I, I worked in a pub, right? And the landlady there would swear by... Oh, because it just smells exactly like Vimp Door. She would swear by, right? If you weren't well... Say you'd have a hangover. If there was anything, right? Anything was legit wrong with you, right? She'd be like, have a port. You'll be fine. And do you know what? It tastes horrible. If you sit there and sip, sip it, especially air the dog, oh, you'd feel a million times better after a port. This is exotic bloom. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. Oh, it's like, um, it's like cleaning stuff, but not like disinfectant. Do you know what I mean? But like washing, washing powder, I would say. Like, a, like surf or something like that. And this is blue sunshine. What does blue sunshine smell like? We're going to find out. But the Katie's nose is going to tell you what it smells like. Ah, oh, it smells like sweet and maybe coconut. It smells nice though. They all smell nice and they smell like I could eat them, but I know I can't. Oh, there was another one. Comfy blue. Did you know blue is my favourite colour? And if it was up to me, right, I would... Uh, the whole house would be blue, but Adam's like, it's a bit too much in it. And I was like, it is, but I would. I'd have every room blue. I just love the colour blue. But I did do the living room blue. Oh, that's nice. That smells like um, fabric softener. You know, like comfort. <sighs> it's lovely. Like baby. It smells like baby. Do you know what I mean? Baby. Um... Yeah, so I did the living room was brown and then I, I put the wave wallpaper up and I painted it blue. It's a mystery butter box. Ooh. And uh, now it just feels really cold in there. Oh, are these wax melts then? No, I think you put them in the bath. These are cute. Does anyone know if I put these in the bath? Or do I burn them? I feel like they're for the bath because it says harmful to aquatic life. With long lasting effects, so avoid releasing the environment. So, you know, dispose of it properly. So, I'm guessing maybe it is wax melts, then I don't know. I don't know. I'm not aquatic, so I'm going to use it. So, we've got Bahama Breeze. And I need a scissors to open these ladies, so we're not opening them right now. We've got diamonds. Oh, 
Oh, there's loads in here. So I will, I will let you know what they're like. I'll pop them on Instagram. I'm not very good to this, like, showing things, am I? They're good though. Again, they look like sweets and I want to eat them. This is, you know, I can understand all them kids that were eating bloody Tide Pods. Because if I was a kid right now, I'd be like, oh, mom, he's in a box of really nice smelling chocolates. Yum, yum, yum. And then the rest is uh, this stuff. I don't know what it's called. Poopery. Poopery. I'm doing this. Don't they just look like uh, cheesy what sets? I need to prank the kids for their cheesy what sets and see what they do. I hope everyone's having a good Thursday. I'm waiting for a Chinese currently. Uh, I didn't want to cook. I'm not going to lie. And uh, the kids have been fed. My mother fed them earlier. And, uh, oh yeah, we got one more year, by the way. So I was like, uh, I'm not cooking, mate. I've got Chinese. And I've ordered... <coughs> Sorry. I've ordered chop suey. I've never tried chop suey. So I don't even know what it is. I haven't even Googled. I guess it's like chow mein or something. I don't know. What is in here? Right. The Amazon guy this has come from. So this is a gift from one of you guys. It wouldn't be a YouTube video without this and you now would uh... Can I just say I am gonna open a cafe soon because I've definitely got enough bloody tea for you all. All of you I've got tea for you all. I am now the proud sponsor of Yorkshire Tea, whether they want to be or not, because I just get lots of tea sent to me. Enjoy your gift from Nikki Barry. Nikki Barry. Does everyone want to come over for a cup bag? Because I literally have got probably enough tea bags for all of you to have one cup like. Oh. And you know what Adam has kept them posh tea bags we had in his bloody van. And I haven't even tried one yet. And the sockets are still in the van, so I'm still filming. If anyone doesn't know, I got sockets hanging everywhere in my house. Like it's shaming. It's absolutely shaming. But uh, someone sent the sockets. Adam didn't put them on a wall or... No, it's too busy now. But thank you, Nikki. And thank you for everyone who has sent all this amazing stuff. Um, I'm overwhelmed. I'm loving, like, the little hair bows and, like, the tea, that tradey t-shirt. Amazing. Uh, also... Oh, I'm surrounded by tea bags right now. Also, right, um, I'm almost sitting 200,000... Okay, I don't know how to say it, the number, but that number is a big one. So I need some challenges. I don't know what to do. Adam was meant, I was meant to wax and, you know, uh, fake tan Adam's legs when he got to 100k, but uh, he's creeping there, so that's not happening. It's like you're all trying to take the fun away from me. It's not fair. Um, so yeah, I don't know what my challenge could be. Whatever. Let me know. Drop it in a comment or something. I've got to do something big and I, I just don't know what, like. I just don't know what. And what else is going on in life right now? Yeah, Rue wasn't well. Um, I still haven't found a wedding dress. Although I texted my mother at like one o'clock last night and I was like, do you want to come with me Tuesday to a shop so I can try stuff on just so I know what kind of wedding dress I want to wear because I don't even have a clue, like. I've never got married before. I don't know what bloody dress. I didn't even have a proper prom dress. I think I've still got to my prom dress somewhere. I just bought it from TK Maxx for 20 quid. It was just like a normal dress. Everyone was like, to the hilts glammed up. If I find some photos of my prom, I'll put them up so you could see. Like I was proper rebel. Um, yeah, so I don't know. I'm not a girly, girly girl. Do you know what I mean? It's dress and all that. Oh. I asked Adam as well. I was like, ah, last night, oh, he's such a bloody wanker. I got a guy right. Close your eyes and envision me, you know, what am I wearing my wedding? And he went, um, a Bruce Willis, a Bruce Willis vest with like a tablecloth attached to it. He's no help, like, he's no help. I may just wear that for a laugh. I mean, it would be cheaper than buying an actual wedding dress, wouldn't it? So, anyway, I'm just babbling on now. So, I will catch up with you all later and thank you again to everyone i messaged on the 
to TikTok saying like why is she banned and stuff. I really do appreciate the support and everything you guys did. And you did reduce my ban for me, so thank you very much. You did get heard, you know what I mean? They do need to sort it out because I'm not doing anything apart from supporting you all and trying to bring a bit of happiness to everyone while we're all having a shit time and they're just being dicks. So, <clears throat> TikTok, yeah. <laughs> Right, I'll uh, speak to you later, like, subscribe, the bell, all that stuff. Once you've rung the bell, you can go to your local pub and have a pint. Ciao!